Our coach, congratulations, and obviously a, a character building victory. Yeah, exactly. We, we needed that. We needed to be down, come back, and be in a super intense playoff atmosphere. You know, that's the first great volleyball game in two years for this program, and I'm proud of these guys. They stuck with it. Um, things weren't that positive last year. Things weren't that positive in the first half, but they've all worked hard. They're all good student athletes. They deserve this, and uh, I'm happy for the guys. Definitely a team effort, but at the same time, if you can call it, the volleyball gods were there as well because if there were you know, balls that just, just dropped in or, or were in, uh, always went in your favor. Yeah, and it's like I said, you got to be good to be lucky. So when you're not thinking about things, that's when the ball drops in your favor, I, I think. So some of those digs and some of the things that happened there were a hot team getting some bounces, and so it's great to be at home. Josh Milani, player of the game, and uh, he came up with some, some big kills and some big plays when he needed it. Well, Josh Milani's shown what he can do, and what he can do is be a world-class player. So, you know, he's out there, he stepped up. You know, Landon struggled early, and I said to the guys, hey, Landon was rock solid last night, someone has to step up, and Josh took it upon himself. Big blocks, big serves, big attacks, and uh, that's the guy we recruited to, uh, you know, be a top player in this country. Four in a row, uh, what do you expect from Calgary? Calgary's going to be tough. They play us tough a lot, and uh, you know they're they're higher in the rankings. So this is now stepping into that. Definitely, this is a playoff team. They've basically essentially secured a playoff spot, and uh, they're a tough team. So got a storied history with them, and I'm I'm really happy it's back to back home in this one because we could use that little extra rest.